Okay, so there you have the soda stream opened up there, and there's the two valves. Here's the bleed valve, and the other one is, I believe, for uh, letting air into the bottle. So I've taken this one out, the plastic one, and this is the one that tends to back off and cause the soda stream to um, release pressure before it's built up its full pressure. So you can see here is this plastic thread backs can back off and change the pressure of the spring, which will cause the uh, the pressure of the system to relief relieve earlier than it should. So all we have to do is first I thought we had to lengthen that spring, but now all we have to do is really just turn that in a little bit further. And be careful because you can turn it all the way in so that you can't actually get at it anymore. I don't know, we'll try that much. It was definitely more than that when I took it apart. So we'll see how that works. So now you see that it doesn't start bleeding off until it gets to the three white lights again. Before it was starting to bleed off at one and two lights. So it seems like adjusting that plastic uh, spring mechanism and the valve was appropriate.